government will be ready to undertake the voluntary national review later this year at the ending of the first session of the workshop titled Achieving Performance Targets. Minister of Foreign Affairs Carl Greenwich, who is performing the duties of president, re-emphasized the importance of setting the tone and completing the groundwork now. If you're going to get there by 2030, it is understood that you can't wait until 2030 to determine whether you've arrived. It is understood that you need to have benchmarks. In other words, if you're saying that you would like um, levels of education to be higher, then you need to monitor them over time. Collect information, monitor, monitoring the indicators, and then determine whether you need to adjust policy-wise in order to speed up or change direction, change scope, and the like. Minister Greenwich explained that of the 17 goals, every country's priority would be different. These are goals that we work together on as countries, informed by you know, analysis, social analysis, priorities of different countries, the main one being, of course, to move people in a meaningful way from the current status that they have, particularly in relation to poverty, health, education, and uh, these other goals. Participating countries are seeking to ensure inclusive and equitable quality education, the promotion of sustained, inclusive, and sustainable economic growth, urgent action to combat climate change, and more. The United Nations meeting of the High-Level Political Forum on Sustainable Development will be held from July 9 through 18.